going to give you five micro expressions you need to know when you're talking to somebody, whether you're building a relationship with your clients, with your prospects, with your employees, or you're just talking to your husband or your kids, and you have a goal for this conversation, whether you're selling to them, you're trying to win an argument, or anything like that, knowing these micro expressions will show you when you need to pivot, when you need to do more of it, when you need to do less of it to help you reach your goal. My name is Shauna Anderson Newt, and I'm the president of Spitfire Advertising. We help our clients build relationships with their prospects, their clients, their employees to help them reach their goals, to help them grow their business. Today, learning about these nonverbal communication, the micro expressions, that'll help you for business and your personal life. So here we go. Five micro expressions that you need to know. Number one, disgust. What does disgust look like? Crinkling the nose shows the upper teeth. You might even get a, <gasps> right? They don't like what you're saying. So whatever that is in that moment, move away from it. Second micro expression, anger. Eyebrows are tense, eyelids are tight. The top lip is tense. Whatever you're showing them, they don't like it. They're getting angry about. You could be pushing too hard if you're selling to them. Back off. This is their sign without them using any words that they are no longer engaging with you and they do not like what you're saying or they do not like what you're doing, so stop doing it. Happy, probably my favorite emotion. So easy to see this micro expression, but it happens, remember, in a glance, so you gotta be quick when you see it. I have a friend that's a photographer and she looks for this micro expression when she's going through the pictures from a photo shoot and she wants to capture that moment when someone's truly happy in the picture. So this is when your cheekbone reaches your eyes and the smile lines show. So whenever you're showing them talking about in this moment and you see that micro expression, you know they're truly happy, keep doing it. Keep bringing them into that, keep going down that route. That is a green light. Come on, come on, come on. So keep going with that. Number four is fear. Okay, when we are fearful, what do we do? Right? We pull back our eyes because we try to remove all this tissue as far away from our eyes as we can so we can see everything around us. There's usually a little gasp with it too. And we kind of breathe in. So if you're showing them something, maybe it's a price, maybe you're trying to encourage them to do public speaking and they're scared to death of it, and you see that micro expression, stop, tweak it, make them feel comfortable, bring them back into their body, and then you can start working towards your goal. But that's definitely a point where you're like, okay, I gotta stop here and figure out what is making them fearful in this moment so you can make them feel comfortable or you will never get them on board with what you're saying. And the last one is contempt. So contempt looks like a sideways smile, a smirk. You know you've done it, you know you've seen it. This means that I'm being pessimistic, I'm not on board with what you're saying, I'm really not buying into this. So you don't have them engaged. If you see that, then you do not have them engaged and you need to get them engaged. So stop whatever you're doing, whatever you just said, whatever you just showed them, and get them back into rapport with you and then you can move on. So those are the five micro expressions that you need to be looking for when you're doing any sort of conversation where you're you have a goal for the conversation. So if it's something with a client, something with a prospect, with your employees, with your spouse, with your kids, you can use this in any area. If you're trying to win an argument, look for these different micro expressions. So we talked about disgust, anger, fear, happy, and contempt. Go back and watch the video or hopefully you made some notes and just memorize these. They're really easy, so just watch for them. Remember, in a moment, you have to be paying attention. I would love it if you would share this out on social media, if you would email this out to your friends, to your family, coworkers, whoever needs to hear this message. It is my mission to help people build deeper relationships in their professional life. This video helps in your personal life too, so if you would help me with that mission, I would truly appreciate it. And you know what I always say, the most important tip today? Remember to smile, because happy looks good on you. Have an amazing day.